Now we're going to go to what we call a three-point dribble or a moving dribble. We're going to have this line face this way again. And what they will do is still bring their left hand out in front of them. But this time, instead of dribbling just straight up and down, they're going to move the ball in all different directions. This is our moving dribble. This is where they learn to control the ball under pressure. When defense is putting pressure on them, they can learn to control it and keep their eyes up. Let's try that with the moving dribble and our partners. We'll really have to concentrate on getting your eyes up now. Left hands out. Go. Move the ball all around. Dribble it hard. You got to dribble it hard. Go higher than your knee. Yeah, knee height right there. Move it all over. Now once we add movement to the dribble, it becomes a little more difficult. And they have to learn to concentrate on this. Stop. Let's turn the other way. Now we'll work on our left hand. Work on our left hand. This becomes a little bit more difficult when you have to move the ball around. So I think that you ought to do this drill for at least about, uh, I think you ought to do this drill for 60 seconds. The first drill you can do for 30 seconds on each hand as a warm up. This one you ought to do for 60 seconds before you rotate. We're going to cut that short just to demonstrate it for you. Ready? Right hand is out. Work the ball hard. You got to learn to move it around. Look at your partners. And pass to your partner. So that's how this drill would work. We will use it. We'll pass over. They'll do the drill one minute on each hand. This gives you a total in warm up drills and movement drills of about a five minute period for warming up, but it's excellent for them and their fundamentals.